Hey friends, welcome or welcome back. I'm Lindsay and this is Let's Budget. Um, I have been gone for a while, but I did post a video about a week ago. Um, on this channel, we do um, cash stuffings, savings challenges, and most things budgeting. So if you like videos like that, please keep watching. Today we are going to be doing the last paycheck for the year for the month of December however you want to look up, look at it I have a visitor today I don't know if you can hear her but I do have the baby in the room with me the boys are outside playing soccer with each other so I had to bring the baby inside so we are going to get started and get this show on the road okay so what we are working with today this pay period, okay, we have to pay, we will be paying the mortgage, of course, that comes out every two weeks, but we won't share that. We have to pay the car note. My car note is $5.52, but I pay it twice a month, so I break it in half at $2.76. The boys after school care, we have to pay for that, which is $2.14. Guys, going into the new year, I am, I had to re-up on my flexible spending account, so my dependent care account, rather, so that's included. Hopefully, we'll see how that works. And then, of course, we have daycare for the little princess, that's $151. Our cable, which is Comcast, is $291. Electricity for us is... 123 i'm so glad this is coming down guys because it had gotten up when it gets hot here in houston it gets hot right gas is 62 dollars water is 53 dollars y'all why did my water bill get to 200 dollars one time my toilet was running and so it just ran all day long and um yeah, it made my water bills like $198. Even though I didn't film it, I still had to, like, do my bills like I always do, okay? Our oldest son, Champ, uh, he's getting the $75. 20 of that is for allowance. The other 55 is for baseball fees. And then our youngest boy, we are going to call him Mr. Personality. Um... He gets $50 to his, that goes to his savings. Now, champ savings already go, are automatically deducted. So, I don't have to um, add anything extra to his. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but somebody is getting their yard um, cut. So, I hope it's not too loud. So, we will be working with 2443 Dollars. This comes to a total of. Let me get out my calculator, friends. Oh, hold on. Let me change it. Okay. Let me change it. Two seventy six minus two fourteen. Oh shoot. Did that wrong. Plus two fourteen. Plus one fifty one. Plus two ninety one. Plus one twenty three. Plus. 62 plus 53 plus 75 plus 50 equals 1,295 dollars. 2443 minus 1295 equals. So we have 1,148 dollars that's going to carry over. For our cash envelopes, our cash envelopes don't change. Groceries will be two hundred. Petrol, I did reduce my petrol to a hundred dollars because gas came down. HOA is still twenty five. Once I save this last twenty five, that sinking fund will be um, fully funded, and I'll be ready to pay the HOA fee at the beginning of the year. The yard is $20. Yes, I'm still paying a yard man. Miscellaneous is $20. Pest control is 15 
household I reduced household by five dollars to fifteen dollars car maintenance is 25 y'all that car maintenance always comes in the clutch I did get my tags done I got my tags and my um inspection all that came up to about a hundred bucks so I do have an overage in car maintenance but I'm keep saving it just in case you never know if you need a tire if something happens some you never know so I keep funding that one beauty has been reduced to fifty dollars it was a hundred uh, moving forward I am gonna be doing some DIY things ie I'm planning to do my own nails for the year of 2023 y'all pray for me I don't know how that's gonna go um, family fun is twenty dollars we haven't we don't have an outing plan so we'll just add it medical is forty dollars um they still haven't been reimbursing me for the braces so I'm waiting on that eating out is seventy dollars and that is my normal total of six hundred dollars give me just a second guys okay sorry guys the kids I don't know what happened um so uh my cash envelopes total to six hundred dollars eleven forty eight minus six hundred that leaves us um remaining it seems like a lot but it's not remaining we have five hundred and forty eight dollars my dead snowball which is actually a bill i should always put that in there my my dead snowball is still at 250 which leaves me $298 to do as I please. Now, I'm not going to do as I please with this $298. I will be adding some money to my dead snowball. Um, <clears throat> but we'll see if this pans out. Like, I plan my money, and then I get nervous that, oh, by the time I get paid again, I'm not going to have that much money left over. So I really want to see if by the time the uh the two weeks is up that i have 298 dollars i will get back with you all and let y'all know if this is true or not i don't know if y'all can see everything let me turn it that way okay okay yeah so it's 298 so anywho um we have just told our money where to go with the last check of december I'm actually excited for the year of 2023. I still have some uh, exercise goals, some financial goals, just some life goals in general. Um, I hope everyone is having a good holiday. And with that, my friends, we have come to the end of this um, budget with me. So until the next video, my friends, have a great day.